Manchester United nil, Southampton nil, Manchester United only gaining one point today against Southampton, the Saints, Manchester United going a man down, yes, a player of ours let us down and his name is Casemiro and you know it, Casemiro has that red card tendency in his game, you know he's got a competitive edge, competitive streak and he gets himself into trouble, so it was going to come again, we lost Casemiro for another free game, just when we just got you back in the Premier League, you have to just get sent off again and it was a VAR decision that held that got to this result into this situation where Casemiro himself got sent off. Yes, I don't believe it was a red card, absolute red card. I believe it was yellow at best. And I think this referee is a scumbag. We're not gonna blame the referee today, but he did at times look suspicious. Look suspicious. Looks like you were being bribed and paid, bro. Like you was against us today, bro. Like it's like the, it was 12 against 11 today, which was the Southampton plus the referee against Manchester United. To the time it got to 12 against 10, and we wasn't getting anywhere with that. That first half, Manchester United had a good start in that first half. There was opportunities. Sancho looked so lively. Chances were being created. Rashford as well. Bruno oh, at times as well looked good with good passes, but then. It made me sick in the second half. Neil knew at half time was thinking, all right then, Casemiro is off. Let's try and galvanize something. Let's try and get a sneaky 1 0 win. But we didn't do that at all. Casemiro being sent off had a negative effect. Yes, in the second half, Southampton had the ball. Manchester at that time was able to break through, but. Bruno at times giving the ball away and that's one thing about Captain Bruno he does these stupid things that you think bro we're a man down fix up why are you doing this stop it Bruno think clever make the clever passes control keep possession what is wrong with you Bruno Fernandes pissed me off at all and Aaron Wan-Bissaka as well giving the ball away and there was opportunities there as well for Manchester United to get the goal hitting the post as well Bruno hitting the post Southampton hitting the post in the second half as well but Manchester United overall drew it was nil-nil at full time and we drew disappointing result for today because I thought three points was needed and to for us to continue climbing up and securing the top four securing third position but we've dropped points today um, it's one point that we take. Uh, it is disappointing, Manchester United fans, because we think that, yes, we need those points, especially the fact that yesterday Liverpool as well lost. We can get some momentum as well to get that three points to make us smile as well. And ah, to Liverpool! Yes, you can hold that seven-up cherry in your face about. You've been golden seven-up for the whole damn week. Now you get to get the taste of your own flavour, your own drink, which is a cherry flavour against Bournemouth. Anyway, guys, it is what it is. Manchester United have dropped points. Got a point. We move. We prevail. To, again, we got next week against Real Betis. So, yes. But it is disappointing for Manchester United to not get three points today. And Ten Hag is disappointed. Casemiro has disappointed a lot of people. He probably let himself down. We saw him tearing a little bit. And he was upset with himself. Hopefully, he can get himself back together for the, for the return. But he should be playing next week against Real Betis. But it is what it is, as always, guys. Let me know what your thoughts on today's game. Your, your man of the match, because I don't have none. Because my man of the match is nobody. Everyone plays shit as well. Bruno, Rashford, all of that kind of stuff. I went psycho. Let me know who your donkey of the match is as well. Your thoughts. As always, guys, remember to subscribe to Red United TV. Remember to smash that like button. Press that notification bell so you can be the first one to watch a video when I release something out. And then check us out tomorrow. 8 p.m. UK time on Instagram, Red United TV 1 for the catch up as we analyze today's game. It is what it is. It's your boy, Everest Spice. This has been your match reaction. Till next time, remember to keep it united and remember to keep it Red United. Your boy is out. Peace.